BGM Okay, so you have to be a, a, a man's queen. Uh, yeah. You can call me princess, but... Yeah, you can call you princess, but you're his queen. Oh, that I'm a queen, yeah. Yeah, great. Um, at what age... I'm gonna do this one again. At, 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 at what age do you think, or would you say, that a man is ready to commit for a serious relationship? What is the, what is the right age? Ooh, that's tough, because every person has a... Like his own stuff in their life that happened, and they all need to like work through it. Yeah. Um, and for the guys, yeah, we all know that guys are uh, slower with growing up than girls. It's yeah, science they said it. Uh, mm -hmm. But if I need to, I don't know. Actually, I don't. Know. Would you say under thirty or above? Just to help you out. Below 30 or above. In, in average. What would you recommend average, like the average man? They should commit uh, to a long lasting relationship before they 30. I think so. Okay. But... Does it say... They all... Uh, we all should do like what we feel comfortable with. And if you can... Uh, if you don't think that you can commit yourself to someone, yeah. You shouldn't do it because it's only gonna hurt her or him and it's just not gonna be anything good. If you communicate it, if you're gonna say I'm I'm about Yeah, I don't know if I want to have a long long relationship or just have it with you in three months, I don't know. If you communicate it's it can be better. But, yeah, I don't know. Y'all boys are weird, so I don't know when you all, uh, like, uh, growing up and stuff like that. Okay. Yeah, just, uh, okay. Being your stupid self, of your, your, your little version of yourself in your mind, even if you are 30 or okay. 40 or 50. I got a couple of new questions for you because you're doing so good. You were telling me, like, uh, men should commit before they are 30. Uh, is there a specific reason why men should commit before they turn into a serious oh, relationship? No, it's actually why would you should? Self, yeah. I think I have like a. Um, I think I want to have a real long-lasting relationship, and when I say long uh, long-lasting, I mean like a marriage kind of stuff, like a real home with someone. Yeah. And I want to. I want to have it before my thirty. And it doesn't need to be. Uh, I'm, I'm just. I'm 20. Ah. So I have like 10 years in my 20s to do everything. Yeah. You should do everything. If you're a man, if you're a woman, you should do everything. You should try everything you want in life. Yeah. But I do think like if when you're 28, yeah. 29, 29 maybe. Yeah. That you can have some children yeah i'll commit to some woman because i know how bad it is if you don't ah i have a my uncle is a he's above the 30 yeah he's still uh looking for a girl still looking for her uh, for his uh, one uh, less lonely girl i don't know <laughs> but uh yeah he's living his life he has a beautiful apartment but don't you want to feel like something more when okay. you come into this apartment, you feel me? Yeah, I feel you. Like, You're doing really good. Like when you about the 30, you just want to feel that feelings. You want to feel more, even if you are a man, because then you more grown up than when you were 20. Okay. Well, I'm gonna because you're doing really good. I'm gonna give you another question based on this one. What is the maximum age difference? What kind? What age should uh, if you met a guy? What uh, <laughs> what age would you prefer? Uh, if I met a guy... Yeah, or you're, maybe you have a boyfriend, but you said you're 20, so you could tell me something about the age difference. It's um, quite interesting. All right, so is there, is a, there a maximum? There's no maximum. Uh oh, wait, wait. Hold There's on. no maximum. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> there is a maximum. If you are... Uh, if it's like 50... Uh, my parents are... Uh, they have eight years separate. Yeah. My mother is the older one. 
Yeah. So I never had like a thing that my uh, boy needs to be my my age, or he needs to be older, or he needs to be younger, or there, or that the maximum is of ten years or five years. I don't know. For me, if I feel the connection with you, and uh, if I like you, yeah, then we're gonna go with it. Okay, that, so age difference is not I a. Mean, I'm, I'm not a, now 20. I yeah. wouldn't date a guy who is 35. Okay. How old, how old do you think that I am? You. I think you are 30. I'm too old, I guess. 31? No, I'm too old for you. Oh, so you're more <laughs> I'm, I'm over 35. All right, so sorry. <laughs> no, no, no. It's a compliment because she's part of I was younger, so that's great. No, we're just kidding. But it's just an indication. You are, you. If some, if I would, if somebody looks younger, it's still okay. Yeah. It, okay. Okay. It, it's that's a good. The, it's about the inside. All right, okay. guys. We all about the inside. About your feelings. Give okay. your girl. Give your woman some feelings. Love them. Appreciate them. Yeah. Uh, and communicate, please. Because we don't know what's going on. We don't know what's going in there. And we all just okay. need to do some... Okay. I got a couple of questions, then we're done. It, you're doing really, really good. I'm really happy with this. Um, this one is the funny one. Like, does the size of a man matter? And I'm asking this because younger men do worry about it so if you could really give an honest All right. you don't want to make them more insecure you just want to give them an honest and a true answer you know you you spoke to woman you were girl you a woman yeah the size matter yes no well actually not believe me the size doesn't matter if you know how to use it but it sex is something you need to give and receive if you only want to receive, so you only want to come, it doesn't gonna happen because we women, we need some more uh, touching, we need some... You need to know what's down there. <laughs> you feel me? You can just go with your fingers and think you good. Would you, would you say that the, it's more important for a man to know how to uh, please, a please a woman? And have a big dick for sure. Yeah. I can I Can I hear this? <laughs> What do you say? You said yes? You said amen? No, you said yes? <laughs> you said oh yeah! Hell yeah! So that is that is the that is the whole bottom line? Yeah. Please, your, you need to know how to please your woman because the size of your dick doesn't really matter. But let's say if you have this selfie stick and you would... the, the top... The, I don't know, it's not... So, yeah, is that... that's pretty small. Isn't that... It, it, wouldn't that be a... Uh, I'm just gonna be agree. Would it be totally no problem? If you would be sweet to me and if you would Yeah, be really, really sweet, me, yeah. I, 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 would, yeah. I believe you. But I believe you. Buy some dildos because boy, what's that? <laughs> well, you want to touch it? Yeah. So, but Sorry. I'm I'm just women are creative. You are creative. It's not you can find woman. You will find a way around it. It's not like if it is really small, you you are finding a way. Okay. Um, okay, then the final uh, question. Oh, final question is: If you are in a in a serious relationship, should you be allowed to check his phone? 